Hi, I'm Jennifer Hoffman. I'm the author of a book called The Standardization of Demoralization Procedures. I am American, but I've lived in the um, U.S. only my first six years, and then I moved to Austria and Germany, and I've been living in Berlin now for the last 12 years. If you look at German history, people who didn't grow up there, or even Germans themselves, they tend to split people into good and evil. And, you know, the, the whole Third Reich um, era, or even the GDR era, just sounds so evil, and people like to call it um, evil. For me, that's a way for people to kind of split that, the, that part of themselves away um, so they can call themselves good because um, they never really look into um, how people became that way. So I'd been hearing stories from people who grew up in that era and they were just so insane that I thought, you know, I had to kind of start writing this down. There was one story by a mother of a good friend of mine. They moved into a new apartment and the person who had uh, lived there before forgot their phone. She found a phone in the closet somewhere, which was huge because nobody had a phone. Um, that was a big no-no to own a phone because obviously, you know, you could be calling the West or whatever. So she found this phone and she plugged it in and she like made a phone call. Thought it was weird that the, the jack was even working. And she t totally forgot about it until about two days later or something. Um, the study showed up and asked her about it. She's like, so who are you calling? Where is this phone from? And they almost arrested her and they just didn't because her um, father-in-law was the traffic, the minister of traffic. <laughs> so he got her out of this whole situation and they threw away the phone. And that was that. But that was just one of those stories where I was like, this is just insane. So I need to... I need to start look, looking into this. Hachette.